All right, let's have a look around. An intriguing switch, eh? How does the mental alignment thing work? Here, I'll show you. Huh. Hey, uh -oh. the test subject wears this mind mapping helmet, which probes the brain by measuring fluctuations in skin conductance and electrical resistance on the surface of the parietal lobe. Uh-huh. Hmm. <laughs> When I turn on the mind mapping helmet with this radio switch, the subject is exposed to a series of visual stimuli intended to provoke a series of positive or negative responses, as indicated by these lights on the helmet. Hey now! As the responses are recorded, they're relayed to this special typewriter, which prints out a punch card that represents the subject's mind map. All I see is a bunch of holes. <laughs> well, to you, maybe. But to our mental alignment meter, this mind map is nothing less than a peek into your subconscious. Observe as I place your mind map into the MAM. Uh-oh. Layabout. Layabout. Is that machine calling me a slacker? <laughs> no, your own physiological responses did. Can. What's this? That's a can of used motor oil, rocket fuel waste, and assorted chemical sludge left over from my abandoned rocket car. Ugh. Gross. Accounting doesn't enter into it, but it is disgusting. Would you mind disposing of it on your way out? Oh, I got an uh, item. Sure. Yoink. All right. Stan, what's cooking? That's an old brown family recipe for awesome pepper. Awesome pepper. Rabbit stew. The trick is to add the cumin an hour after the carrots. Take a whiff. Mm, isn't that <laughs> just about the best thing you've ever smelled in your life? It's, um, powerful, yeah. I've got it on a slow boil for later. What the hell? Can I put something in it? Can I put algae cakes in it? Maybe not. Nah. Can, I put, can I put a can of oil in it? I don't want to get that covered in any messy oil. I do. The scientist What's that this? caught Kid Tannin. It's the placard we'll be putting in front of our booth at the expo. The scientist that caught Kid Tannin? <laughs> a small exaggeration, but Edna says it'll attract investors. What do you think of the picture? You look a little... <laughs> constipated. What? <laughs> Edna said I looked intense. Yeah, intensely focused on taking it. <laughs> I get the picture. Hmm. I'll have to find a better one. He's going to get the photo album. There's a lot to choose from. Nice. Eddie. Extremely. Mother has been rather obsessive about photographically cataloging my life. All right. Where the hell did he put it? Damn it. I've got an idea. What? Why don't I take your photo album over to Edna so she can pick out your new picture? That's a great idea. Hmm. She's got a better eye for these things than I do anyway. Thanks, pal. You got Mention fooled. It. So two down. Will he eat algae cakes if I give them to him? Hey, Emmett. Need a snack? Desperately. What is it? Some sort of algae cake. <laughs> it's supposed to be nutritious. Oh, I've heard of these. And now his teeth are green. Oh, oh, oh. They better be really nutritious. <laughs> Emmet. it. Well, I didn't want to walk all the way around, but oh well. What's this typewriter do again? During a mental alignment test, it takes messages from the mind map helmet and turns them into punch cards. Like the one for Mr. Tannen over there. Hmm. Seems complicated. Actually, it was all rather easy to put together. Once Edna gave me the idea. Hmm. Sounds to me like you should be working on harder problems then. What? Uh, sorry, I've got to get back to work. <laughs> What's this? The mind map cards from the dozens of subjects I've tested during the last few weeks. I've got to get them sorted before the expo begins. Why? Edna's got this grand scheme to catalog all of Hill Valley citizens by their mental alignment. Well, this alignment. is how it all started. Isn't that cute? 
Not really. Mind if I go ahead. You should shuffle him up, or what's he gonna do? Hooligan. Ah, oh, that'd be Mr. Needleman's card. I'll just put this in the stack with the other hooligans. Hmm. Looks like you got a lot of hooligans. Yeah, about 90% of Hill Valley thus far. Huh. It's a little disturbing. Really? Looks like you got a lot of hooligans. Yeah, about 90% of Hill Valley thus far. It's a little disturbing. What the hell? Why did... Why... That's an achievement? Edna was right? I don't want to get that covered in any messy oil. I do. How goes the bacteria farm? Not so hot. The bacteria have kind of gotten out of control. I had to put a clamp on the nitrogen tube to keep the stench from flooding the lab. Hmm. Oh yeah, the oh, lab's gonna get stinky. Ew. Oh, did the clamp fall off again? Um, yeah. Put it back on. Well, I don't even know why I keep that bacteria tank around. Every time the clamp falls off the nitrogen tube, it huh. takes a couple of minutes before I can get the stench out of the air. Whew. According to Emmett, this thing prints out mind maps. What the hell's this? Nothing happened. Well, that button advances the slides during the mind mapping test. It only uh, works while the test is running. So while she's in here, I gotta turn to crank. I have to turn on that and the projection screen in the test, and she'll see the picture of Trixie on the wall. That'll convince her. When this is all over, I better make sure to get Emmett's photo album back to him. Record player? I don't care about Trixie Trotter. Ah. I don't approve of that sort of music, but I find it very soothing. There you go, so. It makes sense. Oh. They say I'm crazy, got no sense, but I don't care. <laughs> so at some point I'm going to get, tri uh, what's her name, Edna in here. And what I'm going to have to do... Oh, wait a minute. If I'm going to take Emmett's mind map, I better replace it with another one. Kids. The mind of a degenerate criminal. This kid Tannen's mind map, as captured by our mind map helmet. Can we tell he's a criminal just by looking at this? No, but when it's fed into the mental alignment hmm. meter. <laughs> Weird. Weird nothing. It's science. Huh. So I need, here's what I'm going to have to do. I need to swap those two. Looks like you got a lot of hooligans. Yeah, about 90% of Hill Yeah, yeah, yeah. I need to be able to pick one up. So this machine takes those little cards and tells you whether or not someone's a good guy or bad guy? Kind of. Actually, the helmet does all the work. The metal alignment meter is just a glorified arcade machine. So why not just go with the cards? And it says that people respond well to flashing lights and snap judgments. I can't argue with that. Hmm. Every time I kiss her, I see flashing lights and lose all sense of judgment. No kidding. So, I don't know if I could do this yet, but here's what I'm thinking. Get Edna here. Turn this on so it stinks, right? Turn on the I Don't Care song so she'll hear Trixie's music, which she hates. Turn on the slide projection and show the slide of Trixie. And then... Generator. There's a generator? I'd be careful of that if I were you. Why? Well, the rocket fuel experiment must have stripped one of the teeth in the hand crank. As a consequence, if you turn it for more than ten seconds, it... Oh! oh! I'm having an electric shock. <laughs> yeah, I can show her all this stuff in here, and it'll make her look bad. It'll make him look bad, anyway. There's no other mind maps to grab, right? Just those two? If I'm going to take Emmett's mind map, I'd better replace it with another one. Can I pick up kids? Tannen's mind map. If Emmett's map looked like this, yep. I bet Edna wouldn't think he's such a model citizen. I'd swap Tannen's card with Emmett's, but it's got Tannen's name on it. I'll just have to generate a new mind map for Emmett. 
Oh, how do I do that? He's wearing the... He's wearing the, uh... The thing right now. How do I turn it on? There we go. According to Emmett, this thing prints out mind maps. Oh, wait a minute. Slide advancer. Haha. -ha. I'll do it again. What the hell who are these people? Freaking Grizzly Adams. What the hell? A bald kid dressed like a woman. <sighs> hubba hubba! Now we're talking. Alright. So what did that do? I'd swap Tannen's card with Emmett's, but it's got Tannen's name on it. I'll just have to generate a new mind map for Emmett. If I'm gonna take Emmett's mind map, I'd better replace it with another one. Huh? I'm super confused. Wait a minute. I wonder if there's things I can do to make his mind map go wrong. Like, what if I turn the valve, I play the music, and then I go through the slides. If all those things distracting him, would that screw everything up? Hmm.